So how many electrons does chlorine have on its outside? So we'll do that. So it's missing one electron, right? So yeah. sodium's gonna give that electron. Being a student, that's, that's their job description. And so when a child's in the hospital and they're going through a difficult time, um, it provides that stability, that normalcy for them to be able to continue what they are meant to do, which is to learn. Many students would not have the opportunity to go to their original school. So then having it here, they can pass time in the hospital. The medical benefit we really see is them they getting up at a time in the morning, they have a schedule, they're getting dressed, they have breakfast, they uh, take their medication, and then they go to school. So this really helps us with getting back the routine to them, will help and will decrease the risk for depression, will help us with nutrition. If the patient eating well, if they have a good night-day rhythm and good sleep pattern, the medication will work better. So it's a, it's a real big key factor of the success. I probably wouldn't have gone for, to school for a long time, like many years, because normal schools are way too fast and I wouldn't be able to keep up. If I go at my own pace, it's, it's very easy to accomplish. Now, with my own pace, it's much easier to accomplish the same things. The kids are amazing. They're resilient. They love to learn. Um, they're excited to be here and they accomplish great things. Together, we do amazing things every day.